We are Stephanie and Heather, and this is going to be a review of Kidspiration, which is a concept mapping tool used for multiple subjects in elementary grades, kindergarten through six. Kidspiration also includes activity sections to promote active engagement in young learners. The first aspect of Kidspiration that we are going to look at is going to be Picture View. Picture View has ways to express information through visual diagrams, which allows you to express information in a logical manner. It also allows you to add, draw, and create pictures and illustrations to enhance the appearance and understanding of the information at hand. As you can see, Picture View of Kidspiration is a great concept mapping tool. It allows you to express main ideas and connect them to different symbols in which you can express information through text. You may also show pictures, and beneath the pictures you can show text to describe the pictures in order to connect them to main ideas or to other symbols. In order to link more symbols, you can simply click this button and then drag the symbol wherever you would like. You may also type inside of the symbol to show what you would like it to represent. In order to link symbols, you click the link symbols button and link it to either other symbols or to the main idea itself, and the arrow goes in the direction of the you would like it to go in. You may also add pictures. As you can see, there are several different categories to choose from. I'm going to choose school and then in the classroom. And as you can see, I picked the chalkboard. I can link the chalkboard to main ideas or to other symbols, whatever I would, wh whichever I prefer. And then I can also type inside of the picture to describe the picture or to make connections to the concept map. Also, there are many simple tools such as undo, redo, and clear in which students or teachers can correct mistakes and make changes to their work. You may also change the colors, the font, the font size, the font type, and whether or not it's bold or underlined or italics, which allows for student creativity. Overall, Picture View is a useful tool in the classroom for concept mapping and use of expression through different forms of activities. Picture View can be a tool of presentation by using concept maps and a combination of visuals to teach particular concepts to children. Picture View can also be a means of expression because children can create their own concept maps to show and understand. The next aspect of Kidspiration is the Writing View, which directly correlates with Picture View. It organizes the information through text in an outline format. Kidspiration automatically reformats information from picture view to writing view, as shown below. As you can see, the information that stems from the main idea is indented. You can also add ideas, which will automatically be reformatted in picture view, as shown below. Writing view can be used as a tool of expression to show students correct understanding of the material being taught. It can also be a tool of presentation for teachers who can show information in a different format other than the visual concept map. The next component of Kids Vision is Map View, which consists of six different options. Color tiles, pattern blocks, base pen blocks, fraction tiles, fraction boxes, and free workspace. The first aspect that we're going to look at is color tiles. In color tiles, students or teachers can use different colored shapes on the left-hand side of the screen to create a visual demonstration of mathematical concepts. There is also a graph option located at the bottom of the screen, which will turn the free workspace into what would look like graph paper. The next aspect that we're going to look at is pattern blocks. Pattern blocks are similar to color tiles, but instead of colored blocks, there are different colored shapes that you can choose from. You can also change the color of the shape by clicking the various colors on the bottom of the screen. The next aspect that we are going to look at is base 10 blocks. Base 10 blocks is another option available in Matthew. Here on the left hand side, there are three dimensional sets of blocks that comes in ones, tens, hundreds, and thousands. The next aspect that we are going to look at is the fraction tile option. The fraction tile option in Matthew allows students or teachers to use blocks to represent various fractions or whole numbers. This option is a good visual tool for young students who are learning the concept of fractions. 
As you can see, teachers can create their own equations You can also change the pattern of the box by clicking on the buttons below. The fraction box option is another way of teaching and learning the concept of fractions. There is also a free workspace where one can insert a combination of all types of math tools. This option is great for teachers to create activities for students to show their understanding of mathematical concepts. The math view shows both means of presentation and expression by giving the teacher tools to create visual diagrams to teach children and by allowing children to practice the skills taught in the classroom. Also, in Kidspiration, there are four categories of activities, reading and writing, math, science, and social studies. We're going to begin by looking at the reading and writing activities. As you can see, there are numerous different activities both parents, teachers, and students can choose from. We're going to look at the beginning letters activity. In this activity, Students are going to help develop their reading comprehension skills. They're going to say the name of the picture in the blue box and match the picture with its beginning letter. In addition to the reading and writing activities, there are also several math activities available to show comprehension. One example is adding it up. In this activity, students will use color tiles to show different pairs of numbers that add up to make six. They will also write an addition expression in the green box next to each model. For number two, we will write three plus three because it equals six. And then we will add three blue boxes to show half of the equation and three red boxes to show the other half of the equation. As you can see, these, these math activities can be a means of expression because children can show their understanding of the material being taught in the classroom, and it can also be a way for teachers to monitor, monitor whether or not students are fully comprehending the material in the classroom. The third category of activities is the science category. There are several science activities, but we are going to look at the activity alike and different. In this activity, students are asked to choose one picture from each group that is different from the others. They are then to drag this picture into the empty supergrouper box to the right. Then they are to add two new pictures from the symbol libraries that are similar to the picture that they dragged out. The fourth and final activity category is the social studies category. We are going to look at the activity of the 50 states. In this activity, students are asked to drag the states to make a map of the United States. They are then to drag the postal codes from the mystery box to label them. As you can see, New York, you would drag into the picture of New York. They are also asked to add graphics or captions to point out interesting geographic features and explain the details they added in the writing piece. As you can see, the social studies category is a means of expression which allows students to show their knowledge and to work at their own pace. It is evident that the activity category of Kidspiration is crucial to the effectiveness of the software because it brings about active engagement for students and acts as a means of presentation. As you can see, Kidspiration provides active engagement in many ways. It has multiple forms of participation, which allows for different ways to interact with the material, which keeps kids interested by using unique forms of interaction. Kidspiration is also a good tool because it is fun and easy for young children. The colorful pictures help students to comprehend biblical concepts, and it is good for teachers to create interactive digital worksheets. Also, the activities reinforce lessons and comprehension. Some problems that may arise in the classroom that Kidspiration solves are the complexity of drawing diagrams, organizing information, and the issue of having boring concepts that lose students' interest. All of these problems are solved by the relative advantage of Kidspiration. Kidspiration is a good solution because it is student friendly, engages children by using fun technology, and is age appropriate. Kidspiration acts as a means of presentation by giving students visuals and concept maps that help to implement the material being taught in the classroom. It is also a useful tool for teachers to use as another method of conveying material and information. It also acts as a means of expression by giving children the opportunity to show their knowledge through both activities and creating concept maps and diagrams of their own.